Hey guys. All right, guys. So we're here to do a request, and that request came from these people right here. They asked us to check out this band, which let's say this. I assume they're German, and I assume they sing in German for obvious reasons. I, I have to tell this story. I went to see Soulfly, and there's a there was a guy there that I know that I've met at other shows, and he was there with two German buddies, right? And we were talking about soccer. We were talking about all sorts of stuff. But every shaft. Actually, we didn't talk about Manshaft. I mean, we talked about it's soccer, but but not specifically the Manshaft. I, I mean, it was the first time meeting them. I didn't feel like bringing up the Manshaft would be the best way to sparkle I a think conversation. That's what people are most proud of of their Manshaft. Oh, manshaft. I'm, I'm sure there's not one single German man that's not proud of of, of his Manshaft. I, I highly doubt it. But anyways, what I kept mentioning to them was Das Auto. And then it was funny, as they were leaving the venue, like as, as we were leaving the show, and I was walking to my car and they were walking, I don't know where they were walking to, I remember they said to me, hey, see you at the next show. And I said, Das Auto. And then I heard them laughing as they were walking away, probably thinking, what a stupid Canadian, yeah. you know, what an idiot. A anyways, so I think the name of the band is, is Finster Forced. Sphincter Frost. I, I thought it was Sphincter Frost the first time I heard it, which I'm sure is extremely painful. Uh, like, I mean, ah, yeah, Sphincter Frost would be extremely painful. Like, really painful. That's like natural. That sounds like a disease, though. It sounds like a name of a death metal band. Yeah. Sphincter Frost. Or, yeah. or like death metal folk metal. Yeah. <laughs> you know? All right, so the name of the song is. Uh, the name of the song is funny, too, because the first time I saw the name of the song, I thought it had something to do with my dick frying. But much dick fry. Yeah, like somebody lighted a match in my dick fry. That, that's what I thought. I'm like, sphincter frost, and then you lighted a match in my dick fry. I mean, this song already from the beginning is starting off well, yeah. as far as I'm concerned. And we haven't even heard one single note. Um, are you ready to check out these guys? I mean, yeah. people have been, the, the people requesting this video, they've been like on us requesting this for the last, I would say, two months at least, maybe longer. So this better be good. Yeah. Otherwise, somebody's sphincter is gonna freeze. All right, let's do this.
right? Yeah. All right. So what did you think of that? Uh, let me just start off by saying something before you talk about the song. The, their dry cleaning bill must be absolutely horrendous yeah. price-wise. I mean, these guys, wow. Uh, I think you have something on your shirt. Okay. <laughs> you know? And it's like, where? Here? Yeah. yeah, yeah, kind of there, a little bit more to the left. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Throw like a white shirt, like, shirt, and just go roll around in mud. It looked like oil. It didn't look like mud. A anyways, regardless, what did you think of this song? Uh, it was so. I mean, I didn't, obviously, we don't know what they're saying. No, but, uh, exactly. I mean, I think if you understand the lyrics, then you, get the whole th then you had, exactly. Yeah. I was just going to say that. If you understand the lyrics, then I think you better understand the concept of the video. I'm just guessing uh, what the video I, I is. I think for us, we, we're kind of like lost in limbo there because we yeah. don't understand the lyrics. And, and we're trying to make sense of the lyrics based on the video. I'm assuming the girl was a ghost. I mean, I'm like a, a representation yeah. of somebody he loved and he lost and then made him forget about... The, the I don't know about your interpretation. The interpretation I got was that that was somebody he lost perhaps from his childhood or something like that, somebody he loved, and reminded him of where he came from. And he left that uh, corporate world and he went to and he wanted to go back into the roots uh, of his land. And and perhaps that whole the guy in the cave struggling in the cave and then coming out of the cave is a representation of that. Of you he kind was, of he losing, was caught. He was caught in the corporation. Yeah, so it's kind of you losing track of who you really are, and you and you become a slave to this corporation. When when uh, and then finally you realize that, and you find the light at the end of the tunnel because he's walking through that dark tunnel, and then you find the light at the end of the tunnel, and, and perhaps that's office. you re you regain your self worth and and joy in life perhaps I, I i mean i'm assuming all of this based just on the video because obviously um i don't understand a word they said i, I don't think a single dick was fried during the video no. either I, I didn't see a single one no. but i just want to put that out there so the song uh, by the way the song i want to say this because i don't know what you thought of, what you thought about the song in general but i thought the song incorporated two really different elements that i was not expecting when the song started one was a little bit of a folk element which with you the said accordion. the video of a band with the name sphincter frost a sphincter frost would, would be like a death uh, a death folk metal band i mean this is close enough this is close enough but okay but they added another component they added a little bit of a symphonic component they did. because not only they had the keyboard and there was a melody there they also had this orchestration behind it yeah. and then at parts when they were all singing together almost like a choir it really had a symphonic element to the song. So to me, the song really has three different elements. It has your, your typical metal heavy, heavy song element to it. Then you have the accordion that gives a little bit more of a folk element to it. And then you have the keyboard, the orchestration in the background, and then the joining of all of their voices to give that, that symphonic element. So to me, there's three different uh, moving parts, if yeah. you will, to the song. Do you, do you agree? Yeah. What, what did you think of the riff that came after the accordion solo? Oh, that yeah. riff was absolutely freaking balls. Uh, but the favorite, my favorite part of the song was them all joining in and singing along because that, that, that was so nice. Did the guy have a bandana with Red Bull on it? I think so. Uh, I wonder if they got paid by Red Bull to have that bandana. Anyways, I mean, they couldn't because the, the bandana was full of dirt, so you could barely yeah, see. Yeah, that's true. And Red Bull, I think they're Austrian, the, 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 the brand. Yeah. I think it's an, I, I'm assuming because... There's a, a soccer team called Casino Salzburg, and they're sponsored by Red there's Bull. There's three. There's three teams. There's Red Bull from the MLS. There's Leipzig, and then there's that one. Oh yeah. Okay. So there you go. We have our resident expert. Um, th did you like that riff? I really like that riff that came after that accordion because the accordion, the, the accordion. I, I know you're saying you enjoyed the when they all their voices came together. I like that too. But that riff was really contagious. The one that yeah. came, the, the one that came comes right after the accordion. I was like, oh, I could listen to that riff like forever. It was just heavy, but still melodic. The song is really cool. Yeah. The song is really cool. I really enjoyed it because it had all of these different elements that I was not expecting. I was expecting this to be more like Varg. I'm not going to lie. Which uh, Varg is. Varg is better. By the way, we yeah. need to check out more, some more yeah, songs. Yeah, we only did Varg. one. We only did one. We need to check out some more. All right, guys. This is it for today. For this request, come back tomorrow. We'll have more videos for you. See you guys. See ya.